On day 97, we got picked up by Switch, who surprised us with donuts and chocolate milk. He dropped us off back where we left off at Copper, and then we started heading south toward Twin Lakes. Hey guys, we got dropped back at Copper, and we're headed south. We're gonna do about 28 miles today. We do walk through like the Copper Resort, which is really cool. I used to come snowboarding here all the time. One of my favorite mountains to snowboard in Colorado, so it's kind of cool being back here. But uh, we may get like a drink or something up here, and then uh, today is actually going to be pretty easy. It's like barely 5,000 feet, over 28 miles, and we are ready for a good day of hiking. Oh yeah, the weather's supposed to be really nice today, so that's exciting. Except it's very cold right now still for little old me. So this is the point where the Colorado Trail and the CDT are merged. Like we're on both the boat right now. You've seen this, cool. is this is so cool. Being back. Look at this. Ah, copper. a cabin down there called Janet's Cabin and we are going up this pass we're on the Colorado Trail so mount bikers can ride on here so we've been having to dodge those guys wow She just hangs out there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hi, sweetheart. Yeah, she, she walks sometimes. Hi. Oh, oh my goodness. So cute. Yeah, she loves this. Look at her. She's looking for Pika. <laughs> I saw you in a distance and I was like, what is that? What's a big ass box <laughs> on top of it? So I haven't been talking to the camera because you guys probably can't hear me, but we just went over Kokomo Pass. We've done 11 miles since Copper, and we have a really chill like rest of the day. It's pretty much like downhill and flat. We're still on the Colorado Trail. I don't know how many miles we are going to be on it, but it's cool to be on the Colorado Trail. We've seen a few CT hikers, the people with the cat. Oh my gosh, that's the coolest thing ever. Life goals. But yeah, it's a really big day today. Thank God. We, we were kind of like due for one of those. Kind of nasty every day since we got here. Yeah, just taking it all in and really enjoying today. It's always been a dream of mine to hike in Colorado when the aspen trees are changing colors and we are hitting it perfectly. This is so beautiful. Ah, oh my gosh, look at this. Oh. <laughs> 
what's in here. Uh, I'd sleep in one if it's cold. Not a needle in sight. <laughs> Just trash. Everybody gets their own room tonight. <laughs> Pull it. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> yes! I need a soup Yeah. It's like a hot soup. Rolls over soup. <laughs> We made it to Tennessee Pass. There's a lovely privy here that I will hopefully use. Well, here we are. Here we are. Okay. All right, we took a soup break at a random place. <laughs> soup break, <laughs> made it to Tennessee Pass. Used the privy, and now we have three more miles to camp. I've been zoned out, just enjoying fact that it hasn't rained on us today so quite nice um, yeah we may have to turn our headlamps on a little bit but we're very close to camp and I'm ready post all vehicles sign we'll get that the Sarah you look so what? unbothered we need we need girls picks does it swing? Oh, it does. Oh, yeah. All right, so <laughs> Get out, Sarah. Oh, <laughs> uh, there is a full moon, and it is so beautiful. Oh, I wanted that hike so bad. But these fools don't want to. There's so many signs out here. We have so much flat. It's so nice. Okay, we made it to camp. I'm in a cowboy under these trees. And, um, yeah. Okay, this is what's for dinner. It's like a fancy ramen that comes with the uh, three flavor packets. I'm gonna add a chicken teriyaki. I haven't eaten much today, so this is about to slap. Look at all these seasonings for the ramen. Oh, so good. This is, this is the best. <gasps> I just did that. I just did that.